Unborn baby has her own schedule for birth, thank you very much. Bad Taiwanese baby! If you were born on U.S. soil, you get citizenship. Being born in U.S. airspace just complicates everything! You were just hours away from Los Angeles! Okay, so that was more than a tad racist. We have no idea if this unnamed Taiwanese woman was traveling from Taipei to L.A. just to give birth. But when a 30-plus week pregnant woman hops on a plane to the U.S., it's also not the world's craziest assumption. But whatever the case, six hours into the flight, the approximately eight-month pregnant traveler was rudely awoken. The little one had decided now was the time. Flight attendants and a doctor who happened to be on board came to the woman's aid as she began the miracle of birth at 30,000 feet. Deciding not to take any chances, the pilot diverted to the nearest airport in Anchorage, Alaska. 30 minutes before they landed, a baby girl was born. Reports say a U.S. Border Patrol agent came onto the plane after it landed to check the woman's passport, which is kind of understandable, but also kind of dickish. It is generally legal to fly if you're under 32 weeks pregnant, but if you give birth in U.S. airspace, your kid's nationality is usually that of the nation the plane is registered in. In this case, the Republic of China or Taiwan. But sources say it is possible the child's passport could read birthplace in the air. How cool is that? Like this video? Don't forget to subscribe and follow us on Facebook, Google Plus, and Twitter.